welcome back to the Star Report. Thanks for tuning in. Let's get right to it. It's a huge weekend for the Rams football team this Saturday when they host the UNLV Rebels. Now this game is very crucial for the season um, for the Rams because number one, it's the uh, opener of conference play and uh, it'd be really important for them to start the conference play with a victory. And uh, number two, it's against a beatable opponent, UNLV, who uh, was picked near the bottom of the conference along with the Rams. Uh, because after this game, the Rams play three of the next four games against the top three teams in the Mountain West, UNLV, BYU, and TCU. So uh, I think, uh, you know, you can talk about rivalries being the uh, biggest games of the year, but I really think the, uh, the game of the year so far is this weekend against UNLV, um, who has played much better than people expected them. Uh, the Rebels beat a pair of BCS teams so far this year, highlighted by a victory over Arizona State. That was at Arizona State, who was ranked at the time. Uh, they also beat Iowa State of the Big 12. The uh, Rebels are led by a pretty solid group of receivers. Um, their best receiver is uh, Ryan Wolf, who had a huge game against the Rams last year. So hopefully the CSU young cornerbacks can continue to play well and uh, limit his production. Um, another key to the game is the Rebels' run defense. It ranks near the bottom of the conference actually they're 109th nationally in run defense so it'll be interesting to see if Rams can get their run game going um, hopefully Gartrell can really establish himself as the go-to running back get him maybe 20 plus carries get him in a rhythm and really take control of the game um, another key I think is the health of Ricky Brewer and Mike Pagnotta two guys that were banged up this week during practice If those guys can't go or if those guys aren't 100 percent it might be a challenge for the rams defense to keep up with the uh, spread attack but uh i think the rams are going to be able to pull through this one really buckle down um i think last week's loss really shook them and uh i'm looking at a 27 24 rams victory star report thanks for tuning in